Crash, thank you. Earth Day is tomorrow and across Metro Atlanta events are happening to promote awareness around recycling, reusing, but that also takes some year round effort too. Liza Lucas joining me this morning with a really cool program that some students at Georgia Gwinnett College are talking about. We think about the cafeteria, even just restaurants in general. Unfortunately, there's always a lot of wasted food. Well, not on my plate, but yes, in general, <laughs> about 3,000 meals go through the dining hall over at Georgia Gwinnett College. The waste can add up fast. Twice a week, Stephen Johnson and Keaton Hartfield come by the Grizzly Dining Hall, collecting leftovers, which add up fast. It's uh, varied from 80 to 120 pounds. But from the trash comes transformation. I can barely stick my finger through this soil. It's so hard. Now, if you come over here, you look at this soil that we've got here, this is a much better base for the plants. The difference comes down to those dining hall scraps converted into an organic material, a rich ingredient for healthy soil. So we're taking raw material and we're turning it into compost. It's a cyclical system from raw to the soil to producing good foods. Stephen launched the Roots to Shoots program last fall, inspired by his own roots growing up in Jamaica, where his family routinely composted waste. The result at Georgia Gwinnett College is more than a senior project, a rich micro farm with the shoots now starting to show. This bed is probably going to give us about 100 pounds of potatoes. Student volunteers work the space, producing fava beans and herbs, tomatoes and corn among the produce to come. When I first came here, none of this was here. It's just crazy that I'm a part of this process that, and see how it's growing like this. The hope is the garden can go full circle, from students' plates in the dining hall, recycled to the roots in the ground, and back to students in need. The food destined for the college care pantry, not to mention local food banks. We could do a lot with what we have here. We could sustain the college and we could sustain people in the community as well. Now, Stephen Johnson, he is thinking big. He says it might be a micro farm, but he wants to go macro with this plan and expand not only at Georgia Gwinnett, but an idea he hopes can be replicated on other college campuses as well.